In transforming from a Mazda Miata, the 124 Spider's interior received the least makeover attention. At first glance, the two Roadster's cabins are the same. The interior of the 124, however, benefits from upgraded materials and finer detailing, with more bright work and fancy lateral seat ribs. Fiat also fits its own steering wheel, shift levers, and gate faces. Standard 124 fare includes cloth seats, while Lusso models sport leather coverings and a Barth 7 mixture of faux suede and vinyl. Even with a power advantage of 5 to 9 horsepower and 36 pounds to foot of torque versus the Miata's 2.0-liter 4-cylinder, the 124's turbocharged 1.4-liter 4 is the lesser engine. It's lump, lazy, and delivers less all-out performance than the Miata's mill. No changes to the 124 Spider's turbocharged 1.4-liter inline 4 or either of its 6-speed transmissions, meaning performance stays the same for 2018. The Fiat's turbocharged engine delivers its power in a lumpy fashion, unlike the naturally aspirated 4-cylinders in the Miata and the Toyota 86. Blame the engine's copious turbo lag, the time it takes for the turbo to spool up and increase output, for the delayed power delivery. When the turbo's boost does come on, the engine's behavior changes as if you'd flicked a switch, dumping a pile of torque all at once. The Miata's inline 4, conversely, gradually develops its power as it spins faster, making for more predictability and snappier response. Where the Toyota 86 and Mazda MX-5 Miata are autocross and track day darlings, the softer handling Fiat is the small roadster to buy if you prioritize sunny day cruises over track events. Even though Fiat tunes most of the Miata's hallmark body roll out of the 124, the standard versions of the Italian roadster respond to driver inputs in a duller, more relaxed fashion. The stiffer sprung of our model is more of an eager little scamp, and every 124 benefits from quick, feedback-rich steering and good body control when the road deviates from the straight and narrow. On the flip side, this means the Fiat 124 Spider rides decently for a small, flyweight roadster. Its suspension is tuned for calmer response to lumps and bumps than the Miata's, so it doesn't bounce around as much on the highway. Blindfolded passengers wouldn't be tricked into thinking they're riding in a Mercedes S-Class, of course, but the ride is tolerable despite its general firmness.